Welcome back. This is my triangle program. Uh, it's great for geometry. Uh, as you can see from the main menu, it doesn't really matter. It can start off anywhere, but this main menu, the first one is a 30, 60, 90 triangle, and then 45, 45, 90 triangle, then an odd triplet, and an even triplet. Uh, we're going to go through a bunch of different things on, on these triangles because this is a more complex program because triangles are everywhere. So I'm going to start off with something simple. I'm going to say 30, 60, 90 triangle. Oops, let me get out of this. I'm going to do a 30, 60, 90 triangle. And it's asking you what do you have. If you know it's a 30, 60, 90 triangle, and let's say you know you have the large side, so in this case L is for large side. I'm going to say the large side is 8. If the large side is 8, then the smallest side is 4, and the other side, which is the middle side, is 4 radical 3. You hit enter. And then it's linked to a Huron, which is called my Huron. It's my Huron. So it gives you the length of each side. And it also tells you the area and the perimeter using Huron's formula. Last and definitely not least, it uses law of cosine to find each angle. Now, I do not want to do this again because I want to show you some more stuff. So that's pretty much, you know, the basics. You have 30, 60, 90, 45, 45, 90. Your triplets, your odd and even triplets, you know, they pretty much run exactly the same. So I want to show you these other ones. Now these look kind of weird. Now the first one, it's an inequality. It's an inequality when you only have two sides, A and B. The second one is an inequality when you have three sides, A, B, and C. And you have your law of sines and your law of cosines. Uh, the one I want to concentrate right now is on the inequality with using three sides. Pretty important in geometry. So, given I can make up any values, so I'm just going to make up, which is my pet peeve, the triangle one, two, three. And it tells you that this is not a triangle based on where it fails. Because 1 plus triangle inequality states that given any two sides must be greater than the third. So in the first case, 1 plus 2 is not greater than 3. So it gives me a fault, so it doesn't work. So I'm just going to hit enter. Do you want to try it again? This time I'm going to say yes. And I'm going to put sides that I know work. I'm going to do 3, 4 and 5. Ah, it tells me it's a triangle. It goes through, it tests it to make sure it works. It tells me it's a triangle. Once it's a triangle, then we can get this. It's linked to Huron's formula, where it tells me each side gives me the area and the perimeter. And then it tells me each angle, using law of sines or law of cosines. I usually, I like law of cosines better, because it's easier. In this case, I'm going to say, no, I'm not going to try again. So I'm back here. Now, I don't want to do this again, even though you've just seen some of the things. I want to show you the last thing, which you're probably familiar with. Now, the first one, the first one is Pythagorean Theorem, basic Pythagorean Theorem. The second one is <laughs> when you have points of a triangle to solve things. Uh, labels. It's probably confusing you. And the last one is postulates and theorems. Uh, I'll do labels really quick. Just to explain it. Labels is basically C-I-C-O-M. C-I-C is something I remember. It's circumcenter, incenter, and centroid. The O is orthocenter. The M is mid-segments of a triangle. Pretty important in geometry. Do you use it all the time? Not really. Uh, the other thing, postulates and theorems. This was actually created by a student. I just linked it to mine. I'll give him credit where credit's due. And basically, it goes through all the pos all the postulates, all the theorems that you could use that you can come across, like the angle-angle postulate. 
angle side angle postulate, side angle side postulate, side 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 postulate, and then angle angle theorem, hypotenuse leg theorem, and it goes back and forth. But you know, what if I missed one? Oh no, I want to do hypotenuse leg. Oh, I didn't know what uh, angle side side. And it basically it'll go backward and forward. You know, I could do whatever. It doesn't really matter. But you get the gist of what goes on there. And I can go back to the main menu if I like. It brings me back here to the menu of postulates and theorems. And this is my first choice, which brings us back to 30, 60, 90, 45, 45, 90, and the triplets. And that's my triangle program. If you have any questions, you guys.